Want to bring your table tennis game to another level? Looking for the best table tennis paddle but don't know how to decide? We have reviewed some of the best, good and not so good paddles. Also referred to as table tennis racket or ping pong paddle. After careful review we have selected an editor's choice which we will be mentioned right away. After the editor's choice and two more selections we will describe the testing methods we use to determine the ratings toward the end of the video. So without further ado here is the editor's table tennis paddle top choice for 2017. Killer Spin Jet 800. Three words suffice to describe the Killer Spin Jet 800. Power, sensation and precision. Number two and three respectively are the Stiga Pro Carbon and Stiga Supreme and all are elite level paddles with only a few points separating these three paddles so you cannot go wrong with any of these top three paddles. Here is the criteria we use to grade the table tennis or ping pong paddles. Power, the first of these ratings. Power reflects not only the hardness of the material used in the blade and handle of the paddle but the padding used between the rubber surfaces of the paddle and the blade. All blades are laminated wood glued together, sometimes with a thin layer of fiberglass or carbon fiber sandwiched between the layers to provide lighter weight and less absorption of energy. The power rating is more of a measure of how much energy the paddle absorbs when returning a shot. The higher the number, the less power the paddle absorbs, providing a much stronger return. A drawback to a higher power rating is that it can come at the cost of control of shots and therefore less preferred by players with a more defensive style. Meanwhile, many offensive players look for paddles rated in the nines. Control. Next is control, which reflects how true the paddle strikes the ball as well as how long the paddle holds the ball when hitting it. This has more to do with the quality of the rubber, thickness of batting and the direction of the pips on the rubber face. As a rule, the tackier the rubber, the more control you will have with your shots, allowing for better placement of returns. As well, a couple of millimeters of foam can provide a lot more control, usually at the expense of power though. Finally, if the face of the paddle has a rubber pips facing outward, it gives you more grip as you strike the ball, usually at the cost of spin. Defensive players prefer high control paddles, although advances in construction have led to a rise in the control ratings of all paddles. Spin. Finally is spin. Spin again has to do with the quality and insulation of the rubber, but also can be improved through a lighter blade. Many players, whether more offense or defense oriented in their styles, will look for paddles that provide spin, as it can make returning their shots more difficult. Higher spin paddles will usually have the pips of the rubber facing the blade, allowing for the ball to be struck with a smooth surface. As well, they will be a lighter weight, allowing you to have more fine manipulation of the paddle. Even then, most paddles with a higher control rating usually carry a similar rating and spin. Through using these guidelines, you can find the best table tennis paddle for you and understand the criteria we use in determining our choices. Rounding out our reviews are the Sly Spin Rapture, DHS Hurricane, Paleo Master 2, the Stiga Titan, Butterfly 401, Killer Spin Jet 200, and the Maple 4 Star. If you found this review helpful, please click the link below the video to help us keep these reviews free. Much appreciated.